Hello all my friends and crafters. It's Carol here today and I wanted to share with you this project. And it is using this Tonic Studio die right here. And it is called the Peony Bloom Handbag. You can see it right there. It is a gorgeous die, fun to create with. I know I've been missing for a little bit, but it doesn't mean I haven't been crafting. It just means I've been very, very busy. I have still had to work during the pandemic and uh, I've got a lot of things going on in my life. So uh, I'm crafting, but I haven't been doing many videos as of late. So we're gonna have this video here and I'm gonna have another one after this with a bee themed happy mail project that I did. So be sure to look for that. So without further ado, I'd like to show you uh, this project. I'm going to bring it down. You can see I made several of them. It's probably why I've been missing because <laughs> I made so many of those. So I'm going to show you this one here. And I created all my own flowers with some dies from my stash and this also it says a gift for you is a die in my stash and all these extras right here come with your die set and your die also cuts this uh, pretty top on top of the uh, purse itself as you can see here in this picture i'll show you really quick it has these also that you can use i didn't use that I just um, use the accent dies for this one. So for my purse, I made this little uh, clothespin clip to clip at the top. And I used a My Creative Time bow die for that. And you can see that this uh, paper is uh, like a rose gold, so that's what I had used for the glitter paper. And it's really shiny and really pretty. So it has a clasp, it opens up, and then I fill the inside with lots of stuff. So I was thinking in terms of giving this to women. So of course, <laughs> or girls or whatever. And I made this little box right here. And this is made with uh, this die from my stash. It's a little box. And inside it, I have put two, I'll show you, it's two bottles of uh, fingernail polish. Aren't they cute? They're just right. These This comes from the Dollar Tree. Um, this nail polish, it's really, really cute. It's sparkly nail polish and two of them fit perfect inside of here. And then I just have a, a flower that I made and a little die in the background that this top just slips underneath so it stays closed with a My Creative Time bow on it. And then uh, to go along with the fingernail polish I created this little box myself with the bow on it and inside this is some uh, nail polish remover pads and let's see if I can get this open now for some reason I can't get it open <laughs> oh doesn't that always happen when you're on camera all right here we go there it is there is the little nail polish remover pads and this just closes up and I wanted everything in a box I didn't want it uh, you know single because it just makes a better presentation and then also I created this which is a lipstick box with this die right here from Elena Crafts and you can see that uh, I put a flower there on the top and use the X and O. And I just put a lip balm in here because 
uh, I don't like to choose somebody's uh, lipstick color. So it's got lip balm. And then for the last thing inside of here, what purse would be complete without some candy? So I have this really pretty candy box. And when you open it up, you can see my favorite candy in there, Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. And this is also another uh, die from, I think this is, this die right here is uh, Nicole Silhouette die. It's a candy box. And I love this die. This is a nice die. It comes with all the added uh, pieces on it to make it really special. And it was easy to put together and I have a acetate window in there. Really cute. So that is this project and you can see I have several variations. I have this one and I have this one. You can see how they all come out so beautiful. And then I did something with silver with this one right here, blue and silver and black. And they all have uh, what's what you saw in the inside. My favorite paper <laughs> in the pink, really pretty with gold. And then I made one with a black uh, purse. This is uh, Prima paper right there. And I did a few different little flowers on that one. And then I've got a purple one here. So I am ready for gifts, as you can see. I've also done a green one with the uh, mint paper from Michaels. It's B, it's like B, something my mint, something like that. And that, that's really pretty paper. So that you get an idea on how you can use your dye. So thank you everybody for watching. And be sure to look for my bee themed happy mail video coming up soon. And until next time, everybody, be healthy, be happy, be crafty. Love you all.